The male ZDF rat is a widely used model of type 2 diabetes. It shows many similarities to the human type 2 diabetes patient in that it displays glucose intolerance and insulin resistance and gradually develops beta cell failure and frank diabetes. Because we use stereology, we can determine the true mass of beta cells. We do not work with fractions, but with real numbers. Interestingly, we can see in the figure that our investigation into the development of beta cell mass in the male ZDF rat clearly shows a massive initial increase in beta cell mass, driven by a proliferation of the beta cells. As the figure shows, this proliferation can only continue until a certain point, around week 16, at which time beta cell mass declines again. Histologically, the beta cells in the ZDF rat initially look healthy. Then beta cell mass expands, before apoptosis leads to deterioration of normal islet structure and loss of beta cell mass. Contact us if you have a study you want to discuss.